Hello there, Dr. Ola Kalawale here. Today I'll be answering the question, should I attend a Caribbean medical school? But before I proceed, here's a little bit about myself. I'm a family practice physician and a Caribbean medical school graduate. I'm also the founder of MedMatch MD, where I help pre-med students make an educated decision of choosing the right offshore Caribbean medical school so they can fulfill their dream of becoming practicing physicians in the United States and in Canada. MedMatch MD allows students to compare close to 40 different Caribbean medical schools side by side so they can get to a decision on choosing the right school for them. I have carefully curated information that will help students choose the right school. I always advise pre-med students to apply to as many U.S. and Canadian schools as they possibly can or U.S. or Canadian schools, depending on wherever they, they live. However, if you don't get accepted, don't give up. You have, you have various options, including applying to an offshore Caribbean medical school, which is a valid and acceptable alternative to still being able to fulfill your dream of being a doctor. I chose this route many years back because I just didn't want to spend that extra time reapplying or trying other options such as getting a master's or a post back or what have you without that guarantee of acceptance into a U.S. medical school. Myself and so many other doctors have successfully graduated from Caribbean medical schools and are actively practicing in the United States. And, and you know, in a few cases, some, some docs are practicing in Canada. My goal is that you succeed regardless of the path you take. I'll encourage you to consider attending an offshore Caribbean medical school if you have been unsuccessful in getting accepted into a U.S. school or if you're a non-traditional student like myself who simply just wanted to get the ball rolling, wanted to get started without having to wait that extra year or wanted to get started without having to, you know, do, you know, get extra degrees. See, the reality is less than 50% of those who apply to U.S. medical schools actually get accepted. And in Canada, it's less than 20%. So there's a significant number of students, regardless of how competitive their MCAT or GPA scores are, that won't get accepted into U.S. or Canadian medical schools. Unfortunately, there's just not enough seats for the number of applicants. And that is why the option of going to a Caribbean medical school would be a valid and proven alternative to allowing you to still fulfill your dream of becoming an MD. I encourage you to visit www.medmatchmd.com and search as well as compare close to 40 Caribbean medical schools so you can get to a decision on uh, what school uh, is right for you. Also on that website, you will be able to access accreditations, USMLE pass rates, whether or not schools have clinical rotations in the US, tuition, etc. I also um, want to encourage you to take advantage of a seven day free trial of MedMatch MD website and uh, go to the site, you know, get the information you need, and I hope it helps you in making deci the decision of choosing the right school. All right, well, that's it for today. I hope I've, I was able to answer that question for you. Uh, again, it's a personal question. It's a question you have to answer for yourself, but I've given you some tidbits um, of information to help you um, narrow down your decision. The, your decision. All right, again, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, I hope to um, you know, see you, see you on the other side. I will be uh, creating more videos. So uh, stay tuned. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.